Good evening ladies and gentlemen, I'm Super Ego and we're back with Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. In the last episode I believe we started looking into this Plague Bearer incident. Um, and now I think we're going to head back to Santa Monica to, well first of all, see if we've got our rewards from getting the werewolf blood. Secondly I'll check in with Arthur Kilpatrick, let him know about um, Milton and Durban. Excuse me. If I can, I'm not sure whether I can actually go there to tell them anything. Um, and we might even crack on with the Elizabeth Dane quest. So to do that, we've got to go all the way back to the taxi around here. Uh, I don't think I can buy anything. <clears throat> Need a ride? Yes, Santa Monica. So I always Hurry, wanted it to be slightly different when you return to always room for previous areas. I don't know how different, but damned. just to show that something's changed. Don't think enough games do that. Did you miss me? Judging by the way the board's lit up, I'd say. Hey there. Need something specific, yeah, like, so or uh, just here to shoot the breeze? So many callers, so little no, time. No, I can't do anything. If you don't get through to me. Let's go and do the Elizabeth Dane quest. Down to the beach. I have seen the squirming on the horizon. The worms are stripping the foulness from the skull of the We need to get on the boat, have a look at the sarcophagus, find out what the police know, and what was the other thing? I think we've got to get the cargo manifest and report back to the prince like a good little boy. Like a good little boy we are. Oh, who's this? Hey, you, hey, what can I say? You preserve my ass. I truly appreciate you not saying anything, and I want you to know I take care of those who do me favors. So from now on, you need equipment, info, you come see me at my apartment. Don't hesitate. Look like you're feeling better. I tell you, that blood you guys got's an amazing thing. Help close up a few wounds. This back alley patch fixed up the rest. I needed that beating. Good reminder not to overestimate my ability. Last time it's gonna happen. Might need some equipment for this little trip. really got his ammo. Doesn't seem to be much cheaper than where I was buying it before. Oh, there we go. Some full anyway. Well, not on that, I'm not, but I don't really use the guns. So let's get on this floater. Oh no, it is in the water. It like it wasn't. Yes. And the shore is nowhere in sight. I'm guessing this is the ass of the ship. For Christ's sakes. Tell Jacobson if he plans on making editor in chief, he's got to start working with me. 
I can't keep getting him these scoops if he's gonna send high school journalists who don't know enough to wear something that would blend in. Uh, Jacobson didn't tell me much. Jeez. What kind of wood sting? Don't think to at least show dressed up like an investigator, a Coast Guard guy, something. I mean, didn't you ever see Fletch? What, are they just handing out those diplomas nowadays? Let's just do this before one of us has to take a swim. Take it easy, Flash. This is still a badge you're talking to. Let's get down to business, Barney. All right, look. I got you a copy of the initial report, and I can get you into the cabin, but you gotta make yourself real scarce after that. Anybody catches you, I don't know you. And no goddamn flash photography, brainchild. Where do we go? Hold up a sec. Heinz to Marsh. Heinz to Marsh. Marsh, they need you up in the bridge. Over. There. The security room will be clear. Head down the stairs behind you and stay low. When you get down there, wait for me to call off the guy guarding gangway A. As soon as he leaves, get your ass moving and don't let him see you. I'll give you a couple of minutes, but don't dilly-dally. In and out, okay? Understood. Don't forget to stay out of sight. If anyone sees you, you're on your own. Take the stairs up to the security room. There'll be a computer in there. The password is Lighthouse. Lighthouse. All one word. You getting all this? Yep. Now get a move on. And don't forget to tell Jacobson I get double my usual fee for this one. Okay. Heinz to Jacobson, uh, Anderson. Heinz to Anderson, come in, Anderson. Come check this out, I just saw a baleen whale! Yeah? Why am I floating? Oh, it's a boat. Filled with blood. Lots of blood. Sarcophagus. Quest log. Uh, then examine the sarcophagus. Get the report and the cargo manifest.
six. Hacking for computer and wits. Not got enough to bump it up. All it did was turn the camera on with the door option. Unlock doors. That'll do it nicely. Manifest. Larry? Quest updated. You're successfully completed your tasks. Awesome. That was nice and easy. Let's get out without killing anyone. Quest in the world. Thought she was on fire then. I've done a lot of crazy things in my time. Never on fire. Nine experience. Let's go see the prince and then maybe spend some of that experience. It's a much nicer experience than playing Alien Isolation. Because I can do this. And not have to worry. Up in. Back to downtown. Oh yeah, it's all made chunk. Officer Chunk. Evening, Chief. You back to see Mr. LaCroix again? Yep, that's yeah. right. Yeah, he told me to send you up as soon as you came in. Lots of people here to see Mr. LaCroix. Nice guy. He seems a little different, though. I wonder if he's... Ah, that's his business. How's it going, Chunk? Ah, you know, I'm keeping the undesirables out and the innocent safe and secure. I'm the thin blue line that separates the crazies from the hard-working decent folks. Yep, as long as I'm around, Mr. LaCroix's got nothing to worry about. Sure he appreciates your hair to protect him. See ya, Chunk. And he's even called the lift for me. 
How thoughtful. I've said all I need to for now. than you think. I don't have time for a monologue. Give me the bullet points of what you saw. Everyone on board was massacred. No survivors. And the Ankoran sarcophagus. What did you see? Blood all over the floor. Handprints indicated it was opened from within. Opened? Let's not jump to conclusions. Give me the manifest in your notes. I'll sort this mess later. You might have noticed when you came in the parade of malingering mollycoddles filing out. Yeah, were they? Those were the Primogen, this city's clan elders, a worrisome bunch devoted first and foremost to the security of their own skin, which is why they were here. It seems Alistair Grout, the Malkavian Primogen, has either forgotten how to answer his phone or is missing. Each minor problem like a grain of sand, each night I inherit the desert. The Sabbat's appearance has put the Primogen on edge. Grout's mansion is in the Hollywood Hills. I need you to pry Grout out of whatever crack he's crawled into and have him contact us. Certainly. Is that all? Yes, for the moment. You know, your demeanor thus far bears similar characteristics to those that rise to the top of this organization. Stay that course. Thank you, sir. Now, about Grout. Yes. About Grout. As I said, Grout is the Malkavian primogen. His behavior and home are eccentric, to say the least. He's developed a paranoid bent lately, so you may have to check under every bed in the place for him. I have something to take care of. I'll go when I can. When we hear from Grout, you may come back. Until then. Oh, and to show my appreciation for your dedicated service to me, I have secured you a haven nearby, in the Skyline Apartment Building. I hope it's to your liking. Cheers, La. Hell of a view he's got. Oh, imagine a vampire, open world, RPG. Oh, uh. be amazing. Anyway, let's go. Ponce, isn't he? Ooh. Hey, uh, I know this might seem creepy and all, but please don't blow me off, okay? Someone told me I could find you here. I mean, I've been looking all over for you since that night because I just wanted to. I'm in your debt. For those I want to help you. I owe you my life, and I feel like I need to repay you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'm Heather. Heather Poe. I'm not weirding you out or anything, am I? For those that have forgotten, this was the girl whose life we saved when we fed her, fed her our blood back in the Santa Monica Clinic. Uh, I'm not weeding you out or anything, am I? That's hard to do these nights. You look much better. I'm glad. Only because of you. What you did for me. Here. I... I got you this. I thought you might be able to use it. I can be useful to you. I'd do anything. Just tell me you'll let me help you. Let me stay with you. Make me feel this way. Of course, Heather. I would love for you to stay with me. Really? I promise you won't regret it. Promise! I'll get you money, I'll get you things, everything. I want to be... important to you. Wait for me at my place. I can't have you following me around. It's dangerous. Uh, I know where you live. I checked there first. I'll wait for you at your place. And when you do come back, I'll take care of whatever you want. I'd do anything for you. My dear Heather. Whatever did I do without you? I'll see you later. Ho! Oh. Right. What are we leveling up? Uh, Malay. 
nine, or eight. Uh, yeah, we need strength. Go with that. Where's the? Where's that plus there? So quests. Uh, don't need to know about that. Don't need to know about that. Earth ground. Um, let's have a crack at the plague bearer quest. Yeah, just hide on the mattress. Let's go kill this plague bear. Uh, poor bastard. Us, but if there's enough of them to feed on, there is. Should I get my blood up to full? Before the fight I'm about to have. It's an old game. There we go. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Hmm. Weird glitch. Yeah, this is the right way. Hell are you? Brother Canker, they call me. High Lord in the diseased halls of the dead. Look around you. The blood. The bloated bodies. The maggot ripped mortal shells. These are the signs. The coming of a new age. Why are you feeding on the homeless? They are the weak, sick, hopeless. I bring them a new purpose. The other vessels of darkness, carrying the diseased truth in their veins. Darkness? What the hell is going on in here? The 
Brotherhood of the Ninth Circle. The darkest dawn is almost upon us. Come, join us in these last nights, spreading our disease upon the earth, sharing this unholy communion with our human herd. That's a human nerd. What the hell? <coughs> What the hell are you talking about? The doors have been opened, the seals broken, and the final steps into the abyss. The terrible mysteries of the ninth circle. The ninth circle. Oh, I don't know what you're talking about, but I've heard enough. Come, join the disciples who have gathered here, floating in their own putrescence. E nice. The mysteries of our brotherhood as I feed on your flesh! Ooh. Come get some, brother. Ooh. Right there. Uh, celerity. Ooh, you bastard, you missard. As hard as me. No. Weird water glitches. Easy. How's that Yeah, that was a rather easy fight. In no small part due to the fact that I'm a badass. I keep pressing C to crouch and stand up. Control. Right, so. Uh, turn this in in two places, do I? Port to Damsel. No, just. So I must go and see Maximini when the whole thing is done. This is just part of the quest completed. I think. Unless I've got to see Damsel, then I go and see Max. Loud noise time. My right bed is dead. On. Except we just did a second one over near the convention center. They're part of some doomsday cult, apparently. No telling how many there are, but it's open season on all these sick sons of bitches. I'll start looking for the rest. Bye, damsel. Ah, uh, yeah. So, this guy, Paul, lives in the same apartment building where we've just been given an apartment by the prince. Let's get out of the air. Too loud. Um, so that's as good a place as any to both end this video and start the next one. We'll check out our apartments, go and see Paul. 
that's the next main quest, seeing about Alistair Grouse. So that can wait for now. Uh, nothing to do in Santa Monica. So yeah, we'll crack on in the next video. Thank you very much once again, ladies and gentlemen, for joining me. And for now, I will say tatty bye.